Advancements in medicine and modern technology has helped research scientists around the world to make incredible breakthroughs and revolutionary discoveries in the realm of the human anatomy. Human head transplants, bioorganic engineering, and nanite technology are a few of these advancements that merely decades ago was seen as only concepts of science fiction. It is no wonder that the general population of people expect the majority of the human body to have been figured out by now, but that appears to not actually be the case. So here are seven body functions that scientists can't explain even in the modern era. Hypnic Jerk Given its name, you would not be able to instantly recognize what a hypnic jerk is and what it entails, but it is believed, in study, to occur roughly one to two times an hour during the average sleep pattern of an adult male and can range up to four to seven times an hour within the average age range of eight to 12 years old. A hypnic jerk, as described medically, is an involuntary twitch that can occur in a person when said individual is in the initial stages of falling asleep. I'm certain you've experienced this, have you ever been trying to take a light nap and then find yourself suddenly falling in your dream and wake up with a twitch? That's hypnic jerk. Though there are many theories concerning evolutionary training and adaptation, the causes for a hypnic jerk have eluded even the most brilliant minds since its discovery. It used to be the general consensus that a hypnic jerk could have been a very mild case of a symptom similar to that of a seizure but further research and investigations in the field of neuroscience has definitive proof that this is not the case. Regardless of the theory, any substantial evidence of explanation is lost among scientists of the modern era and there exists no explanation for this strange bodily function to this day. Photic sneeze reflex. Commonly referred to as sun sneezing, the photic sneeze reflex is a condition that can cause an individual to begin sneezing after receiving stimuli while looking at bright lights or getting an injection in the eye. The study finds that if you are having trouble sneezing and can't quite get it out, looking at a bright light will begin to trigger an autosomal compelling helioophthalmatic outburst, known by its acronym ACHU, and help you sneeze. Further study finds that the ability to begin sneezing after looking at a bright light to be a hereditary gene that a portion of the population may contain while others may not. The sneezes can occur in bursts of 1 to 10 sneezes. Though photic sneeze reflexes are only harmless annoyances, studies into the cause of this trait and response are unknown and appear to be unexplainable with modern science. The placebo effect. If you have ever heard of the sentiment that a positive mental attitude could make a world of difference, take the advice. The placebo effect is nothing more than a change in a mental state that relies on a person holding a positive mental attitude and has consistently proven to be more effective than the most advanced experimental research developments on the market. In fact, consecutively found when testing trial research on new pharmaceutical developments, Groups of patients taking a placebo pill, which is a pill filled with nothing inside that tricks a person into believing they are receiving effective treatment, can have higher treatment responses, increased immune systems, rapid healing and advancements in their overall performance ability just by believing in the effectiveness of the pill and nothing else. The placebo effect has yet to be scientifically explained as any attempt at gathering research data has proven to be inconclusive and popular hypotheses that exist at this current time have a lack of combined research evidence or proof of their theory. Yawning Yawning is a common occurrence by most people throughout the day and most often occurs immediately before and after sleep cycles. As basic as this behavior might seem to the general population, scientists are still unsure why certain stimuli such as fatigue, boredom, stress, and sleepiness cause yawning to occur. Adding on to this strange behavior is the fact that the action of yawning is visibly contagious, which means that if a person yawns, then people who observe this yawning may also begin to yawn despite any other external and internal stimuli. 
There are a number of theories that have been proposed as to the cause of yawning given its effects on the body and the human brain. Reports find that a brain can begin to cool dramatically after a yawn and that increased oxygen and oxygen regulation appears in the human body after performing such a behaviour. Proposed theories of yawning include increased carbon dioxide in blood cells, nervousness, empathy, triggering alertness, controlling brain temperature or subconscious triggers. Despite all of these proposed theories, however, scientists are no closer to uncovering the secret of yawning and the reason for its evolutionary appearance. Additional research data strongly suggests that neither contagious nor story-induced yawning is reliable in children below the age of six or patients along the autistic spectrum. This then leads to conflicting information in research study and could prove to mean that understanding the effects of yawning might be overall impossible without advanced technologies and furthered research in neuroscience. Dreaming Often the target of early religious texts as a means of spirituality and regarded since the dawn of humanity as a gateway to another world, dreaming has always had an air of mystical and magical properties that seem unexplainable in their occurrence and experiences. You might believe that we have dreaming all figured out and that the cause of this occurrence is simple and necessary. But that couldn't be further from the truth. Scientists do not fully understand the mechanisms for dreaming and psychologists regard the action as a bridge between the conscious and subconscious mind, but there still seems to be a tremendous lack of evidence regarding that theory. The belief of dreams being messages from the subconscious mind are age-old. However, as evidence of dream interpretations and attempts of dream interpretation are riddled all throughout ancient history and even into modern times and has proven to be effective relative to uncovering issues of mental health or anxieties. Further research and investigations into dreams reveals even more startling discoveries relative to mental health, REM sleep patterns, and divine inspiration. Overall, the cause, reason, and types of dreams seem to be unexplainable and is often regarded by most in religious and modern reference as more of an ability that lies on the fringes of the supernatural. Laughing Laughter is a pretty hard thing to measure in the scientific world. Even comedians, whose whole job centers around laughter, have a hard time describing and conveying what it can really mean. Laughter allows people to grow their social awareness, to integrate into a group or to isolate themselves away. It allows someone to release tension, make a positive environment, make new connections, and can even work to heal and greatly impact mental illness. Given that humour is an abstract concept that takes a level of higher learning, it is no wonder then that laughter and its evolutionary reasons for occurrence and mechanisms elude us, and even the most forefront of research scientists even to this day. Without laughter, our ability to socially network would be greatly impaired, but purely as a survival mechanism proves to have very little value outside of immediate tribal impacts. Another added fact is that the causes behind laughter can range from logical strings, realizations, satire, and other complex areas of higher thinking and creativity that come from many different areas of the brain. Knowing now how complex laughter can be in the real world and its causes, it could take decades before scientists crack the code behind the biological mechanisms of laughing. Consciousness Questions surrounding the human consciousness could very easily be some of the biggest questions in the universe for humanity. What exactly makes us conscious? What separates us, a living entity, with a non-living entity? What allows us to grow, to change, to think and to plan around the environment and the universe itself? These are the questions that have plagued humanity since it first became conscious and self-aware. What is life? Of course, it is pretty impossible for us to know and to truly understand the mechanisms of human consciousness. The human brain is so incredibly complex that it could take hundreds if not thousands of years even at the rate of technological innovation before we even get close to understanding the capacity and causes behind every function of human consciousness. In fact, 
Some scientists think that it might even be nothing more than misinformation and that human consciousness is not inherently real, but rather an interpretation of ourselves outside of purely physical phenomenon. In this abstract, we could merely be falsely believing we are conscious, but secretly have no free will and everything inside our minds could be merely a product of our universe at the beginning of its conception. Religious and spiritual beliefs directly contradicts this theory and holds that humans contain an almost supernatural power for consciousness to exist outside of the universe and to be a product of divine inspiration, even perhaps manifesting control over our bodies by our soul or spirit that lives on forever after our physical bodies pass away. It is obvious that though there may be an incredible amount of time, energy and research into the endeavours of human consciousness and the biological mechanisms behind it, it is still widely unknown and probably even impossible to measure or to understand. But what do you think of these findings? Do you have your own theories surrounding the human body and these unexplainable mysteries? Do you believe that perhaps these pieces of mysterious bodily functions could soon be explained in the realm of modern science or that they are simply unknowable? Be sure to leave a comment below and help us work together to solve these unexplainable mysteries. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thank you.